Hi and welcome back to the Quick Spin series. Today we'll be adding a Jayco built Conquest Optimum IV25 5B. Yep, that's a mouthful. But anyhow, it's a great floor plan. We recently saw it at the Leisure Fest here in Melbourne. So join me as we go and have a deeper look at all the details. Let's go. Before we jump into this, you may want to take a look at some of these specs. You may want to hit pause, otherwise let's roll tape. So here we are at the Jayco 25 5B. Now this is an Iveco 50 but this is the 210 model. So again 210 horsepower versus the 180 in the previous one. Uh, also fully automatic. But this one has the sleeping Luton, so as you can see it does get the windows up the top there, 231,000. Again, you have the standard Jayco storage areas, picnic table, more robust awning. Let's just pause there to take a quick look at all the external storage on this beast. So apart from the usual generator slide out with its included generator and the external TV mount, this beast has up to six lockers, which includes one wet locker, not to mention all the usual inclusions. Just lightly touching on all the technology that you don't normally see, this Optimum gets WineGuard 4G Wi-Fi and extender. It gets a Sphere satellite dish and 24 inch TV. It also has Bluetooth connection to your smartphone so you can control it all, not to mention an Amazon Alexa and 360 degree cameras for complete view outside. Let's go inside. So standard niches at the door. This one does have the sleeping Luton. I can't get that to go down. Sorry guys. Right, so that's the sleeping Luton. Obviously it has the windows and little blinds. The Iveco with the lovely quilted leather. Now I'll try and get a wide shot, but the fridge is at the front door here. This has a four-seater dinette. Weird how you got a low and a high side. Let's explore that quickly. The standard configuration for this Optimum is a forward-facing four-seat dinette, though you can option in a L-shaped dinette as seen here, but it won't increase your sleeping capacity. Much bigger kitchen. So the kitchen, microwave below. You've actually got an induction hob top in this one. More niches on the back of the thing. Storage under here, the bed's on a slight side slide out, the same as the Switch 442. So much storage in here, guys. Fans, TV, again, wardrobe here. And a big bathroom. So, again, toilet, washing machine off to the side, towel rail, plenty of storage like the black sink and a huge shower. Check out that shower. That's huge. I would do the spin test but I have to undo the, the door so we'll leave it for this moment. So there you go, the 25 5B. So just recapping with some still photos, looking at the cooking area, 
you have a generous kitchen with its induction hob, its microwave and plenty of cupboards for storage. And then moving rearward, you'll see that there's also a generous space under the bed once you lift it up, not to mention the niches behind the dinette. Moving rearward to the bathroom, you'll see that it is a generous area with plenty of floor space for you to do your business. Leave your comments below and tell us what you think of the new Jayco 25B on the Iveco Daily Chassis. Very nice.